Um, there were four times I said no to Rock Hill. To be honest with you, if you go way back um, until um, it was Stephen Turner that insisted I come see it. Because back then it was just about senior housing. And they wanted it to be in this place called the Bleachery. And I saw it on Google Earth. Again, as I said, it was a, in Google Earth image, was a very large, what looked like a burned out factory. Uh, meant the world. So many universities in so many cities don't take that step. They just want a developer to come in and buy everything and just change it. But this city has two huge assets, the university and the business community. The business community, uh, when I met the Knowledge Park Leadership Group, uh, it's the one community that I visited that the business community is the strongest in its support of economic development. Uh, many university towns don't have this type of support. All of the folks on the Knowledge Park Leadership Group have spoken to the challenges of recruiting good quality talent, and it's almost in a mass uh, aspect. It's very difficult to recruit quality talent when it's a onesie twosie job, um, but if we can get a volume of high tech, IT related jobs, um, it is a much easier retention of, those, um, of that quality of talent and be able to attract good talent uh, to be able to grow our businesses. So it's a chicken and the egg sort of thing. But well, the benefits are immense. We um, initially uh, began to think about uh, student housing for our uh, residential students that would have housing, uh, high quality housing very close to campus where they would be able to walk to campus and also get very conveniently to downtown. We also um, are thinking about um, re opportunities for research and uh, earlier in Tim's um, commentary he mentioned uh, a possible activity with, the, with Springs Creative and um, digitizing their um, collection of patterns. And this would uh, go very well with Winthrop's uh, design program and our ability to create a really great research hub for design students. Um, we also have some uh, pretty strong needs for um, providing adult and uh, graduate education for students and we're looking for um, good space for that and um, we believe that the Knowledge Park area can um, provide many benefits that would connect the institution and downtown with these great activities in between that would just um, push us up. In many ways, I think what we do on the, on the public sector side is help set the table so the private sector can step forward. If the city had not made the kind of investments that, we're, that we have made and are making, then we'd be way behind. I mean, we'd be light years behind. Uh, now, you know, quite frankly, we're ready to go. And, uh, you know, I credit uh, David Behan and our staff and uh, a city council that's willing to step out there, uh, all for the long-term benefit of our community. And that's what this is all about. So uh, we're, we're glad to be a part of it.